we did it! Yay! 250 Twitter followers. What? That's just way too many. So stop. I honestly don't even know how to deal with it, so stop it. Let's stop being awkward and go to some questions. What was your first experience with the NLSS like? I honestly don't remember the first actual Northern Lion Live Super Show that I watched. I watched Northern Lion on YouTube for a really long time. I think I've been watching him since before I got sick, so like six years or so. And I remember I started watching him because I wanted to see what The Binding of Isaac was like. And I was really excited for that game to come out, and I was like, oh, here's this guy playing it, I'm gonna watch it. And that's how I found Northern Lion. And of course, through him, I found Nick and Rob and everyone else. And at the time, I was still working and going to school and volunteering, so I didn't have a lot of time for video games and stuff. Um, so I didn't watch the NLSS, and I didn't know there were VODs of the NLSS. Were there VODs at the time? I don't remember. That was so long ago. Anyway, yeah, I don't remember the first NLSS I watched, but I've been watching them for a while. They keep me entertained, because I'm bored all the time. And they're funny. And they make me laugh. And they make me smile. And they inspire me to doodle silly stuff. And hopefully that makes you all laugh and smile. It's a vicious, vicious cycle of smiling. What sort of exotic pets would you like? This is a fantastic question because I actually had a Burmese python for a while. She was so pretty. Her name was Keelan and she got to be about six or seven feet long before I had to get rid of her when I got sick, of course. We had an enormous cage for her and she was real gentle and sweet and just so pretty. Now that I've had experience owning an exotic pet, they're difficult. <laughs> I don't think I'd go back to owning one that big. And in fact, I kind of have an idea for a little farm. And when I say little, I mean I want a farm that's all miniature animals. I want mini donkeys and mini goats and little tiny ponies and it would be the best farm ever. Are you not excited for the cutest tiny farm on the planet? Not that it's ever actually likely to happen, but a girl can dream. What is your favorite genre of music, but I want to see you in the outfit of a performer of that genre? I don't know that I have a favorite genre of music. I love punk and I love metal and I love 90s music because that's when I grew up and I love classical rock because of my dad and I was a raver in my 20s so I've got a soft spot for electronic music and I love all those goofy songs that are parody songs on YouTube and <laughs> I think right now I'm on an indie kick, but that will change. Everything changes. <laughs> and here's me in an outfit that I actually own. Don't judge. And that's all I got. Thank you guys so much for 250 Twitter followers. You have no idea how much it means to me to know that people like my doodles and it makes you guys smile. So I really appreciate it. See you guys later.